Hey neighbors, how y'all doing out there? It's your girl. I'm back with a review and a unboxing. Yes, I've done it. <laughs> it is a pinch me box, y'all. And I saw other YouTubers doing it, so I was like, if it's free, then it's for me, right? <laughs> So y'all, I went online, went through the little process and everything to get the box. And y'all don't know, this is May. And this is a box way from February, honey. <laughs> no, no, it's a box from March. But I signed up in January. I'm going to tell y'all the whole process and open it up. But this is what today's video is about. And they make it seem so easy and quick and smooth. And you get wonderful free samples from large companies. Baby, you work for this free stuff. And it's almost like... Cardi B new album Invasion of Privacy I'll break that down right now I'm not even going to make you wait these people yes they go to big companies and they get sample products but as a consumer if you call or email any big company and ask for a sample of their product most of the time, they'll go ahead and send you out a sample. So is Pinch Me Box really just shutting down the game with this? No, they're not. And I don't want to come off as a negative person, but y'all know that I'm just not going to bring my subscribers anything. So with this right here, yes, the products are free. All you have to do is like a review on it on Instagram, Facebook, some kind of social media so they can get some love for giving you some free stuff. You could have got on your own. <laughs> okay, let me continue. So you have to go to their website. You have to fill out a profile and all of this. And... When I say they want to know all your information besides your ID and your social security number, <laughs> that's what they want to know. They want to know about your household, your income, your pets, all that stuff. And they say all that information is gathered together to help bring you more items that are more suited for you, but they getting your information basically they give your information and you have to take surveys and stuff you don't have to take them but it's um an initiative to where if you do take the surveys you'll receive this or receive that you'll get better stuff in your box and stuff and y'all I was just not feeling it. Okay, I signed up in January. When I signed up in January, the thing is with Pinch Me is once you sign up, you set up your profile, ask, answer all of the beginning questions, you good to go. Your profile is set up. They send you an email like, it almost seems like every day, y'all. So, y'all don't like to receive a lot of emails, don't do this. Because they're going to be sending you a lot of emails with a lot of offers. Some of the offers are good. Some are like junk mail offers. Stuff you know you wouldn't do anyway. But anyway, they send you a lot of emails to do surveys, to do buy something and get something free offers. And if you into that kind of stuff, then this is for you. But for me, it's not. I get too many emails personally and business-wise to be dealing with some emails telling me to come do some surveys so y'all can get all up in my mind and know what's up in here. What's in my mind is for me. <laughs> Not for the whole entire world because you never know 
who is using the information you're giving against you so therefore I don't sit up there and do surveys it have companies that do surveys and to get money but there's better ways to get money than just to give everybody your information because first of all with all these surveys you could say okay a survey ain't nothing you could just put down whatever you want or you can just lie or something but if you a person that try to live a life where you do not lie then that's hard because you just lying to get some money or you're just lying to get a gift card or you're just lying to get a product and I don't have time to be lying for stuff. If I can't get it an honest way, I don't need it. That's just me. Anybody else can do whatever they want to do. But Miss C is talking for Miss C. So I just don't like that. Anyway, I filled out everything in January. Now, to get a box with the free items, they have one day of the month. You have to log into your account at 12 o'clock Eastern and see what samples are available for you. And you click them. But if you come past that time, the majority of the samples are going to be gone or you're not going to get anything at all. And you come, you can't go to come and do that the day before or after. It's only one day a month. So if you're busy at that time, you're going to miss out. So, by the time I filled out my account in January, the day the pick the samples was gone. So I marked my ca um, calendar for February. And that day, I think I got busy or something. And it was still that day, but it was later that day. So, it wasn't that many samples left. So, this is the samples, I think, from February. When March came, because I wasn't doing the surveys and all this other stuff, collecting points, then all the surveys I had was like for Gray's box, where if you buy a box, you'll get a box for free. That kind of stuff and coupons for... um like cookies and stuff like that stuff I don't want I don't know about nobody else but I don't want that stuff so March it wasn't nothing really for me to pick out and when you do finally pick out your items y'all this box takes forever to come if this is the stuff for um, February or either March then it's May now so it just took forever to get it but either way it's free so people say you can't really complain about free stuff but yet and still that's true it's free and they made the pro the the process sound so easy but they want all your information they send you a ton of emails junk emails with a bunch of offers that most people don't want and if you don't do what they do then you don't get all the samples that they show on their little sample video so it's not for me if anybody want to try it try it at your own risk <laughs> but i tried it and it's not for me so that's just my opinion but we're gonna open this box and get into it I mean, and it's cute. I mean, the little packaging or whatever, it's cute. I'm, it ain't nothing about that. It's just all the emails they were sending me was irking my nerves. It's like, send me something something of use or something good I can use. Just don't be sending me stuff to do surveys. And then if a person don't want to do surveys, it's like you get penalized because you don't want to do what somebody wants you to do okay I have a coupon here till the almost the end of this year well not the end but the end of July for two dollars off one package of 
seeds of change quinoa and brown rice. But it's just a coupon. And this is and this is what the coupon is for. It's certified organic. And it's quinoa, quinoa, and brown rice. And I think it's, it feels like um, it's already cooked. You just have to warm it up in the microwave. Yeah, on the back it says, um... It says squeeze pouch to separate rice. Tear a little two inch slit for the food to vent. Heat in the microwave on high for 90 seconds. So that's something healthy. And you just break it up and microwave it. So. That's pretty good because I eat quinoa not all the time. I think I've eaten it once and then um, brown rice is okay. I'm not the biggest fan of it. The second sample they sent me was um, whole blends gentle conditioner with oat milk and the uh, Garnier whole blends gentle shampoo with oat milk so just a sample of conditioner oh and shampoo you can see it right here yeah hopefully y'all can see that really good camera then made a noise okay my battery is starting to run out so a sample of the shampoo and this is a sample of the new sweet heat skittles so yeah that's the samples I got from the little pinch me box y'all was it worth it to get all my information and follow those emails to me, it wasn't, but for somebody, it might have been. But that's my review for the Pinch Me Box. And thank y'all guys for watching. I appreciate it, and I will see you next time. Bye.